everybody. I just want to say a few words about my piece entitled Card for Law. Before I begin to compose a piece, I usually come up with some sort of a stimulus, be it a poem or a picture or sometimes even just a word, and it just helps me to guide my thoughts. And I think it's also going to let you, the listener, into what I was thinking in this piece. I picked the text Carlingford Lock by Marion Clark. It's a very vivid description of a very beautiful place. Um, the piece itself is in one movement and it's divided into three sections. Each of these sections is sort of a different scene from the poem. The first is for soprano saxophone and you'll hear lots of click sounds and air sounds and this is sort of the splashing of the water and the wind on the shore. And at the end of this section Francisco will improvise to the text, a wake sun dribbles kisses onto the tips of newborn waves. I thought this was very vivid sentence from the poem. She then crosses the stage to the alto saxophone, and this move is significant because the poet is now looking at the shore from a different perspective. She sees a ship cutting through the lock, and the waves will increase in size, and you'll hear this in the saxophone. The interval is initially restricted to a quarter tone, and it extends and extends and becomes more and more aggressive, and by the end of this section, Francisco will actually sing into the saxophone in contrary motion with what she is playing. This is the waves sort of crashing into each other. The last section then is quite melodic in comparison to the rest of the piece and employs the use of um, multiphonics. This is where the saxophone plays several tones at once, almost like a chord. And this reflects the several rays of the sun sort of cutting through the clouds onto the shore. The piece is accompanied by a soundscape of waves which are recorded at Carlingford Lock and hopefully it will all take us to Carlingford Lock now for the next 11 minutes or so. So I hope you enjoy the piece. Thank you. Thanks, Amy.